this is Oli. Welcome back to you in Korea. I hope you're all safe and well wherever you are. Let me briefly remind you that you in Korea is a channel for those who love Korea, who want to learn more about this country. Here I'm trying to share with you guys the stories of my life for the past 10 years in Korea, share some facts about the country and maybe some information that is not really well known worldwide. I hope you enjoy watching our videos. If you like them, please subscribe to our channel, give us thumbs up, and leave your feedback in the comment section. It has become a good tradition on our channel at the end of every year to list the major events or issues of that year. And just like that, we also have a tradition at the beginning of each year to tell you guys about something to look out for in the coming year or we make our predictions. So this video will not be an exclusion and today we're going to talk about some rising Korean stars or K-rookies that you can look out for in 2023. Let's look at some K-pop stars first. To me personally, I feel like 2022 was a really, really good year for Korean girl groups. I mean, Korean girl groups were always immensely popular. We have such great names in the history of K-pop like Girls Generation, 21, Red Velvet and Blackpink, of course. But 2022 brought some very interesting names. There were some hot debuts in Korea and girl groups in Korea were seen to be dominating the music charts throughout the whole year. So today I want to look at some names that you should definitely remember in 2023. Our first team will probably be the biggest surprise of the past year. A monster rookie girl group who captured the attention of the whole nation with their super hit Hype Boy. And I'm of course talking about New Jeans. New Jeans is a five member group formed by Adore, a subsidiary of Hype Corporation. The group is composed of five members Minji, Hani, Daniel, Harin, and Hain. The group made their debut in 2022 with their single Attention and rapidly got all the attention of the general public as well as K pop fans in Korea and globally for their fresh and trendy style. The song Hype Boy took over numerous music charts. Its trendy and catchy melody could be heard on every corner of Seoul and also became immensely popular on social media. The group was created under the direction of Min Hee Jin, a former producer from SM Entertainment, who is responsible for some legendary concepts of such artists as Shiny or FX. So I'm pretty sure we can expect even more successful releases from New Jeans in 2023. As all members of New Jeans are very young, we, all of us, we can witness their growth into big artists in the future. So let's keep an eye out for them. Our next team is also a girl group from Hype Corporation, or to be more precise, their subsidiary Source Music. I'm of course talking about Le Seraphim. The group now also consists of five members and had their debut a few months prior to New Jeans with the song Fearless. The song that also topped practically all local and overseas music charts for quite some time. Three of the group's members were really well known to the public even before their debut with Le Seraphim from a hugely popular TV project Produce 48 and the group Eyes One. So the team knows what success is and is sure to aim even for more recognition in 2023. They are known for their crazy dance skills and confident image, so they definitely catch attention and stand out. Make sure you support them in 2023. The next team to look out for had probably their best year in 2022. They are not quite rookies in the industry and some of their members also graduated from Produce 48 and Eyes One. They made their debut in 2021, but it is fair to say that they tested the real success and received immense amounts of public love in 2022. 
I'm of course talking about IVE, the group that is admired by everyone from kindergartners to adults. Their song Love Dive was at the top of music charts for a long time, as well as their recent release After Like, which incorporated the instrumental from the legendary disco hit I Will Survive. They showed various colors with their music and performance. I think we can expect more musical experiments from them this year as well. Our last K-pop rookie for today is the team that we haven't even seen yet. Some of us may not even heard their name yet. The group that everyone in Korea is anticipating to debut soon is called Baby Monster. It is an upcoming seven-member girl group under YG Entertainment. They are set to make their debut in 2023. On December 30, 2022, YG Entertainment unveiled the poster titled YG Next Movement, containing the shadows of seven girls. The poster set midnight on January 1, 2023, is the reveal day for something related to the group. Later on the same day, it was reported that YG plans to introduce Baby Monster member skills and information sequentially through continuous promotions, starting with their first introduction video. Bearing in mind that YG Entertainment has produced some of the most legendary girl groups in the history of K-pop, I think we can anticipate a lot from their debut. But of course, it's not just K-pop stars that are gaining a lot of attention worldwide. Some of Korean actors and actresses are also expected to shine brightly in 2023. The first person among them is someone you all know really well. It's Tong Hoyeon. She began her career as a freelance model in 2010, walking in Seoul Fashion Week shows for two years. In 2013, she competed on the fourth season of Korea's Next Top Model and placed as a runner-up. She started her acting career not so long ago and got the most attention for her performance in Squid Game. She has been quite busy ever since, both modeling and promoting her series. Everyone expects her to take on more roles in the future and show her talent in various ways. So let's support her together. Just like Tung Hoyeon, our next star also became really famous through a Netflix series, despite the fact that she actually made her actor debut in 2017. The real fame came to Cho Hyun after the Netflix series All of Us Are Dead and her part as a zombie girl. With the second season of this drama coming out soon, we all anticipate to see her character's transformations. Meanwhile, you can catch up on her previous works, such as School 2021, Hospital Playlist 2, and others. Our last rising star to look out for in 2023 will be Cho Ihan's colleague from the same series All of Us Are Dead. It is Park Solomon, also known by his new stage name Lomon. He's an Uzbek-born Korean actor who actually debuted at a young age of 14. He has a pretty long list of works. He is best known for his leading roles in Sweet Revenge, All of Us Are Dead and Revenge of Others. He has drawn a lot of attention with his performance in All of Us Are Dead as well as, of course, with his attractive looks. He is considered to be the next most handsome actor in Korea in 2023. So let's look out for his new works this year. Okay, guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was interesting. I will be bringing back more interesting topics in the future as well. So I hope you stay with us. If you like our channel, if you like our videos, subscribe, give us thumbs up and leave your feedback and request in the comment section. I will see you next time and until then, annyeong!